today we're going to be playing with five different camera angles with mid journey. Subject composition and lighting are two different things, but camera angles is also a different thing. So today I'm going to be showing you low angle, wide angle, we have fish eye, we have high angle, and we have drone shot angle. So let's get into it. The biggest hack when putting on your um, camera angles is to put it on the start of your prompts. That way, Mid Journey automatically puts um, importance to that prompt. So I will make one example for each of the five angles and let's see. So this is our first example. Let's start with low angle shot. Cat standing in the middle of a meadow, sunset lighting. So let's see here. I like this shot, but it's not quite there yet. So let's rerun it one more time. And here it is. As you can see here, the, the camera is actually pointing from below up. You can see a part of the leg of the cat and you can see the background. Next is wide angle shot. Prince riding a horse in the middle of the desert castle in a distance view. So we have pretty good examples right on the back. One thing Majority does is it's really good at making stories. So you can see here we have some sort of Middle Eastern concept, castle, we have the sand dunes, we have the horse, and I like the first image. So let's go with this one. I love the overall composition of this image. We have the sunset. We have the prince here on, um, I believe this is using the rule of thirds. And then we have the palace and it just tells a whole story. So on to the next leg of our video. Our next prompt is fish eye angle, man looking through peak hole extreme close-up. So what I want to happen here is I want an eye peeking out of a hole of some sorts. So right on the back, we have our, our first example. I like it. Let's not make it long. And our next angle is one of the most difficult angles to please and to use, which is the high angle camera. Because what happens is most of the time it gives us a drone shot. So as you can see here, our prompt is high angle camera, male vlogger looking at the camera while walking in a forest wearing blue shirt, cargo pants, and sneakers. But look at here, we're getting a drone shot. It's too high. So I want it to be a little bit closer. I want it to be on a first person point of view. So let's try to rerun it one more time. Again, high angle camera shot is one of the more difficult uh, prompts and angles to use. So as you can see here, we rerun it a couple more times. So we're doing some revisions of the prompts. We're adding male vlogger holding a camera, smiling. So there's more like a second person point of view going on in there. Let's rerun it a couple more times. And here it is. Here's our image. So as you've seen through my journey, it's actually um, the high angle shot is pretty much hit and miss. So you have to re-roll and re-roll it until you find the image that best suits your needs. You can revise your prompt if needed. But as you can see, this guy that we chose here, this is exactly what I'm looking for. On to the next. Our last prompt is drone shot, small medieval village, medieval marketplace. So I want it to be like an overview, like a bird's eye view of a medieval village. I want the buildings. If there is a marketplace, much better. And it's actually a very simple prompt and Mid Journey was able to give us the results right away. So there you go. So I believe that drone shot is pretty much the easiest or the fastest um, prompt that Midjourney can decipher, unlike the high angle, um, which took us a couple of attempts to get right. Um, with drone shot, 
we got it right off the bat. Same with um, wide angle and low angle. With low angle, we had a little bit of hiccup, but with drone shot and wide angle, we had the the results right away. So I'm just choosing which image um fits my preference best. So see here. I like that it's a little skewed, like it's not really it's not really zero zero, it's not point blank facing down. Because when you fly a drone, it's not like it's really gonna show like a centered shot, right? Most of the time it gives us like some sort of angled shot from a bird's eye view. So yeah, these are our images. So this is our cat. And this is our um, prince going to a Middle Eastern castle in the middle of a desert. And this is our fish eye shot. This is our high angle shot. And lastly, our drone shot. So go ahead and try out the prompts that we used. Experiment, re-roll, do your thing, and show us your results. Happy mid-journeying! <laughs>